The Transition Monitoring Group, TMG, Civil Society Legislative Advocacy Center, CISLAC, and Kano Civil Society Election Situation Room have kicked against some groups of civil society networks advocating cancellation of the outcome of March 18th governorship elections in Kano. Besides, they distance themselves from those they refer to as faceless groups who cooked up fake stories about civil society organizations otherwise calling for review of the governorship poll in the state. Some groups of accredited uh, observers recently urged the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, to consider a review of the election where Abba Kabiru Yusuf, the candidate of the new Nigerian People's Party, NNPP, was declared winner. At a joint press conference, the chairman of TMG, Awal Ibrahim Rasanjani, insisted that no accredited observer would interfere with the conduct of elections or call for cancellation. Civil society organizations that are accredited with INIC will never call for cancellation of any election. Our work is to observe the process, document it, and make recommendation for an improved election. Never to call for any cancellation of any election whatsoever. It is not part of the mandate of any credible, accredited civil society organization. The spread of this petitious and malicious news in a time when political space in Nigeria is already heated up is not only worrisome, but also has the potential to further overheat the polity. As a champion of democracy, we will never allow snare campaigners and people with politically motivated reasons drag credible civil society organizations in Kano State and indeed in Nigeria at large into political wars with political parties. It is not part of our mandate, it is not part of our responsibility because we are not politicians and we are not associated with any political parties or political or politicians. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.